Perhaps you've seen it. Maybe in a dream. A murky, forgotten land. So the only regret in that fight, minus further experimentational stuff like throwing bombs at him and knives at him and things, which will come later, was... that we didn't get to test the iframes. And I don't really think there's that many of them. But it's always useful to, to kind of know when you're vulnerable and when you're safe. Which I didn't really get a good grasp of. Does that open this? Oh, come on. That sucks. How many locked doors have we seen that could possibly have this key? My sword is, is real debilitated. Oh, that belt on the back looks awesome. I've just noticed it. That is cool as fuck. Um, where does the other lift go? Does it just alternate? Is it just an alternate kind of lift? So there's a door over there. I wonder if that door works. Is this the soldier's key? Yes! Nice! So, is that just a big circle? It is. But that's useful. What's this? What is this? Where is this? I've not been here. This looks... Wow! If this looks like fights are going to happen here, people are going to... There's going to be fight clubs within a week happening in this place. Big all open area to fight and a big door. Produce the symbol of the king. Okay. That's kind of like Boletaria. Is that a chest? That is a chest. I've not been here. I thought I'd been here. But obviously the, the soldier's key unlocks whatever this is. Cool. Got a chaos blade. Ring of restoration and a torch. If that's what I think it is, I'm not wearing it. Gradually restores it. Yeah, I'm not wearing it. So, I'm not the biggest fan of of stuff like that, personally. But it's mainly because it alleviates a lot of challenge. And I play for challenge, guys. I always have. Well, recently I always have. And for Dark Souls, I want it to be... Oh, I can use the bonfire ascetic now. I might be able to fight him again. That's what we're doing. We're going to try. We're going to test it. We're going to see what it does. We've just killed the boss. I don't know where I am. I literally have no idea where I am. <laughs> like, I don't know how to get back. But this is definitely helping. Where is this, though? Okay, shield guy. Guard break. Look at that, man. Some serious stamina there. I thought it would work like ours works, where it does the stun animation. So these guys actually get a little bit of a shit stick. Because they don't get that priority like we do. And he didn't drop anything. So where the hell is this? I can hear stuff moving. To my left. Oh shit! That was cheeky. That where did he even come from? There's a lot of weird spawns. Maybe he was on the floor and I just didn't see him. But that I don't know. Seems a little cheesy. And it happens a lot, so I need to to pay attention. I know this boss fog as well. This is the pursuer boss. This is back to back bosses. And there's a really cheesy way of killing him, which I'm going to try and avoid if I can. But I've got 13,000 souls, so I'm going to homeward bone, folks, because I'm kind of lost. And I can't do this, apparently, because I suck. There we go. Because I'm curious, if I use the bonfire ascetic... If it brings everybody back, it'll bring back the guy who gave me this sword. And if I kill him again, will it give me a better version of this sword? I can... I don't know. 
Weird. So many questions. And a lot of the playthroughs that I watched with commentary, I don't know if it was because the players weren't experienced enough, but they didn't really have any theories or, or questions. It just seemed to be all reactionary stuff, which I just, I don't understand that at all. I'm, there's so many things I, I'm curious about. And, and you are too, probably. There's probably hundreds of folks who are the same. Well, we know that armor piece, black leather. So we'll we'll check Leningrast first before we mess around leveling up. I knew you. So I don't have the ability to do this any further. Large Titanite shard. I don't have it. Um. That takes Titanite. I really like that armor too. It might be worth popping some points into it. Um. Right. Where does it tell you? Is that poise? Seven poise. Seven poise doesn't sound like a lot. In fact, it's not a lot. In spite of my abundant lack of understanding when it comes to poise. I don't want to upgrade this shield because I feel like I'm going to find a better one very soon. What is that? Plus three. Uh, it might be clever to... To just do some levels. And uh, I want to pump my endurance a little bit. I want to pump dexterity. Bearer of the curse. And adaptability, because I, I don't know what they do. So let's have a see. Have I got any more of them? I do not. Okay. I've got a ton of buffs under my name. That looks cool as hell. So I can get eight eight levels. Wow. 15 vitality gives you 1,080 life. How much does it put upon... Everything seems to put your life up, which is interesting. Determine your maximum equip load. So my equip load is not a problem at the, this moment, so I can keep that as it is. Strength is okay, I guess. Dex, I want to put it up because I'm a dex kind of guy and I want to use a katana. Right, what does this do? Resistances, agility. And it looks like it's going to put your poise up, which means poise is a stat that can be leveled, which is interesting. But I don't understand how agility works. And I don't understand if it's just... What if it's the new resistance and I'm blowing points? But that's what this playthrough's about. You know, I'm not meant to know what I'm doing. Uh, Dex. Let's see what Dex does. Dex does quite a lot. So we're going to split between Endurance. Endurance needs to go up. Endurance is probably the most important one. So I'm going to pop it to 10. Gives us some defense. Gives us some poise as well. That's cool. I don't get it, but it's cool. We'll go... Two in that. Oh, no, that's not two, that's three. How many can we get? It's 27. Now we'll do two there, and we'll do two there. And I'm hoping that I've... So, can I swing this three times now? That's a little better. And I don't have that many souls on me, so I'm not going to feel... Oh, wow, she's here. <laughs> buy something. Well, you buy something. Lovely time, so there's another way I could go, but I kind of want to continue down the path I'm on. Yeah, I'm going to stick where I am. Just wish my uh, flappy helmet wasn't as flappy. Oh, 
look at that. A hook weapon. I have no idea how that will work. <laughs> So, let's see if we can get back to that big fog and see if we can fight the Pessoa. Ooh, I've seen that you can parry, but parrying on this game is, is actually pretty tough. So... Is it really viable, is the question. There's some recovery on that if you don't combo it with the R2. Right, I can just go this way, can't I? I think. Oh, fuck! That is a really bad place to turn. I just stood in between two assholes who then spear banged me like it was their goddamn job. Not to worry. It's not what I wanted to do at all, but anyway. Again. I wonder if it's my pad. I don't think it is. I just think it's really finicky detection. Look at him, he's being a bitch with that shield. But the thing with the Pursuer is, blocking him is probably not going to work, so I'm going to have to evade him. That's just how it works. And evading him is going to be really tricky, because iframes work differently, and I've never had to do it. So, pretty much bad news bears either way. Where is he going? Pretty drunk idiot. Look at him! Okay, I thought he'd put his damn shield up. He didn't, he just poked. Definitely going to have to get used to the AI. But it's exciting because it's hard. You know, this game is tough. It's tough already and it's just early, so... It bodes well. So I got bummed here, didn't I? And I can't remember by who. It was a halberd guy that did it. Oh, he's here. Did you hear him? I heard him. He's a premature ejaculator when it comes to firing off early. Which really helps, actually, it turns out. What is he doing? Speed up, boy. Look at him blocking. Probably guard break. Oh, no. I could have, but... And the last hit. Drop rate is really stingy. I want to know how to increase my luck. That's the next thing I would really like to know from. Wow. I'd like to tell you that I had my shield up, but uh, Dark Souls 2 would like to inform me that I didn't. <laughs> Which is weird. Oh, there's another way to go. Oh, no, there's not. It's just that. I can hear a ton of jingling, and it must be just me. But here it is, anyhow, guys. Let's let's take him on. We'll see what he does. We'll see how hard he is. I reckon he's going to bum me, but bumming is, is how we learn. <laughs> Unless it's literal, and then it's, it's how, how we get fucked up in later life. And he does look cool, but if he dies and he never comes back after this fight, what the hell was the point in bigging him up? Unless you never come here and you do the rest of the game with him hunting you, which probably is going to be a playthrough you'll see from me. 
I love how he hovers. It reminds me of the androids from Dragon Ball Z. Which is pretty nerdy, but it's true. Right, so... He's got a dash attack. Here it comes again. It's not too bad to dodge. Ish. A three hitter? No, he did a two hitter. Here it comes again. Right. 118 damage. Not as good as I would have liked. But it's not terrible. I wonder what his poise is. Whoa, he's fast when he wants to be. Oh, that hurt. Oh, range. He has all of it. I have none of it, apparently. This is not... Once again, the battlefield, I feel, really restricts the fight. If it was a little... Oh, that's a bad news. He glowed. Whenever something glows, it's bad news. Whoa, what's he doing? Oh, he's just chilling out. Having a sick break. So I can get two hits and then he... Whoa, that's the three hit one. Two hits and he runs away. Whoa! Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh! I'm going to make some funny noises too and I apologise profusely. I'm a noise maker. He's getting a little bit more aggressive. Have you noticed this? He's not just rushing me like he did when I was hitting him. Oh, that looks like bad news, that. Bad news, bears. And I'm getting blocked into a corner. So, yeah, he's, he's officially got way more aggressive. I'm obviously doing something right. And I'm out. So we just alternate the pattern. I'd love to punish that with like a jump attack, but I'm I'm being a little bitch. Oh wow, rolling attack. Two. And that's not what I wanted, but it still worked. One, two, and there we go. One, two, and dead end! <laughs> Terrible. And crazy th thing that probably steals a soul level or something equally as mischievous. Didn't roll away, you see that? Bad news! Whoa, that didn't even hit me, man. That's some bullshit there. That's your heal opportunity, that, because it takes him ages to do it. That was silly. That was just stupid. And I admit it freely. Get one, get away. Oh, he's spamming it. He's got a little spammy on us. His pattern's reverted a, a little bit. Can we get it off? We can. Two and... Oh, that's just bullshit, man. He's got all the range in the world and we suck. Life gem. Oh, that was unfortunate. Outspaced me. But the good news is the pursuer is not as hard as I thought he was going to be. He's got patterns that can be read, and yeah, it seems like a fun fight. You can parry him, but parrying him seems pretty ballsy. We'll have to try it, seeing as how I, I just, you know, learnt his patterns a little bit. I thought my sword would do more. I really did. Uh, I'm tempted to try the fire one. See if that does a little bit more to him. 156, 159. That's very similar. And this has been upgraded. Uh, let's try that one for a little bit. Just test it out on him. See if it does. It's the silly things though, like... You know, endurance and the arena being a little bit small and, and easy to get backed into a corner. But for the most, I think it's a cool fight. I think it's pretty fun. I'm looking forward to learning it. And being better at it. And this is the wrong way. I like the fire effects. 
fire seems to be much stronger when it comes to visuals than the lightning. The lightning looks a little shitty. Fire, much better. Again, I, uh, I went to put my shield up and I got nothing. I think that's adaptability and it needs to change because it's, it's really not cool. It's something you need to adjust to because it didn't happen in Dark Souls. It just wasn't a Dark Souls thing. Did it to me, the asshole. Oh, yeah. God, spear guys fucking blow, man. They've always blown, and it's nice to see that they blow here too. boss is fair though. He does a decent amount of damage. You can get away from a lot of his swings. Yeah, I think it's I think it's fine. Uh, somebody was tweeting me, a, a guy called Archer, saying that he was bullshit. And I assume he's either low level or he's trying to rush the fight. Because either of those two things is going to make it much more difficult than it needs to be. But, you know, if you play like Dark Souls wants you to play it, you know, meticulously learn things and try things... I think it should be okay. And again, I keep not getting my, my push. I got it that time. Same animation. I expected as much because they were both long swords. So where does this guy... Oh, he's up there. How did I not see him? I'm really curious as to... And the third hit... What if there's a grass crash shield in this game? That'd be useful for this sequence. But I'm tempted to show you the ballistas. Because the ballista nearly one-shots him, which... Seems... Oh wow, what's he doing? He's, uh, he's floating, is what he's doing. This weapon does less damage. And I cannot go through the menu as mid-fight because I suck. So, I'm going to introduce him to the Ballista, I think. I have no idea how you do this. I assume it's X. Yeah. How bad is that? That is really, really, really interesting, but kind of broken. I feel kind of sorry for him that that's there. But, such is Dark Souls. He would not show mercy on us, so we shouldn't show it on him. This increases our physical attack. Give me more. The Ring of Blades is modelled after the Mad Knight of Alcan's weapon. After the Mad Knight of Alcan's weapon of choice increases physical attack. The kingdoms of Alcan and Ven long ago flourished on these very grounds. They were both founded by the same man but we're reduced to rivalry and spite. That sounds awesome. What is my attack now? My attack is 59, 61, and a bunch of 48s and 188s. So how much does it increase when we pop it on? Ah, it goes from 68 to 48 to 68, so it adds about 20 damage. Which doesn't sound like much, but maybe in the long run it'll it'll stack up. So now we've done this, I believe a crow takes us away to a different place. So what we're going to do, guys, is we're going to use the bonfire acetic, and then we're going to come back and try and fight him again. And fight the giant and everything and see what it does. Because if it brings bosses back, which I, I predict it's going to, I am in love with this game. When I can... F Ooh. Hmm. I wonder what he drops. But I don't want to hit him from behind because he's a cheesy bastard. Oh, he didn't even do it. That was not my greatest moment. I think you'll agree. 
He does a second hit sometimes. One, two, three, and four. Yeah, I remember that. Oh, and he just can pull it out of a hat. See what I mean? Iframes. If there were iframes, then that wouldn't have happened. But this this game doesn't have them. <laughs> this game sold them. Sold them for added difficulty. And it doesn't give a fuck if we don't like it. Oh my god. So, I want to go here. Gradually learning my way around, I think. And I want to go to the stone place, the, the tree of fallen gianty place. I would love to find who drops large titanite because I could really do with a piece. Uh, I've done everything here. No, if you remember, I didn't go where that knight was. I lured him away and hit him with the crossbow so I didn't go where those those people were throwing bombs. I've missed an area. And I, I need to check it out because if I'm upping the difficulty, I'd at least like to have everything. And it's it's this. It has to be this. Is it this? I can't. It is this. Oh, I've just come from that area. I have looked over there. Is it down here? Oh, we've not been down here. Right. So we talked to Pate. Pate told us that there was bad shit in here. We was like, oh, bad shit, that sounds cool. And, yeah, this is new. Oh, trap. It's a trap. And someone's got a bow, which is not very pleasant. And I'm getting bummed. And it looks like I'm stuck here, too. Cool. Ooh, throwing knives. What are you doing? You just got a big sword? You just got a big sword. Also, I want to check that area that the bird is going to fly me from because there could have been items there and I just completely forgot to check it. I just got paranoid that it would be a cutscene and I wouldn't be able to get back. Which Dark Souls is great at, by the way. Oh! Hi, guys! <laughs> What's going on? You know, just chilling out in the dungeons with my sword and shit. Halberd person is more dangerous than spear person. Oh, I gave him my back because the lock-on's all twiddly. Right, you want a spear, do you, bitch? Oh, well, that's not what I wanted to do, but it sure doesn't help my point. Nice, he broke my guard. Very clever. Very clever, spearman. They're very aggressive. I love that. I think I'm going to put a different weapon on just so I can swap for the repost. Just so I can see something different. Let's try it with the dagger. Maybe the dagger does a chest stab. That'd be cool. I'm feeling kind of fat. What am I? 57%. I'm still feeling kind of fat. Uh, I really want to take that helmet off, but it's it's giving me item find. Got any lighter trousers? I kind of really like the way the trousers look. Well, we'll keep the gloves off for a little bit. No, in fact, what we'll do is we'll keep the gloves on because I think it made the ensemble look nicer. And I'm all about that, fashion souls. And we'll see what's around this corner. Archers. So it was a trap after all. What was it? Anything worth it? Aromatic ooze. I suppose you could say it's worth it. Spear guy and an arrow guy. Okay. Spear guy's gonna... Two spear guys and an arrow guy. Interesting. And I just... Look at the damage. Wow. That hurts. From somebody that's just an irritant. But... This booby trap has not worked for you, sir. You are not successful. Now, eat my blade. Any more? Just you, eh? Straight for the guard break. You savvy son of a bitch. Stop it! You're a terrible human being. And I just cannot push for the life of me, and I don't know why. <laughs> 
I swear to God, I'm doing it. It's just... Oh, I didn't swap. That's no, all good. I was too late. So I saw a secret here. On a stream. And I can't remember where it was. So I'm going to break this knife on these, these walls. So it's probably further down. But that's one of the disadvantages of not having the messages, is I'm not going to know when there are you know, publicly found secret walls. And there will be lots of them. Where the hell was that wall? I know there was a wall. I just can't remember where. Maybe I'm insane. I wish it was just X. Because then you could just hug walls and mash it. So, I'm certain there's a secret in there, guys, but I can't find it because I, I suck at secrets. It's just something I've had to live with. My secret sucking nature. God, it's getting warm in here. Whew. Okay. How do I get across there? Is it a jump I can actually make? Uh, I don't think so. No. Okay. Maybe it's this way. No, that's that's where I came from. That's Pate. Well, I see you managed to escape. I hope that brave warrior didn't come a cropper either. It's a little bit too conscious of that, strangers. It makes me think he's trying to to red herring us 